Hello, Georgetown ISD families. Fred Brent here with your April 30th update. And I just want to say, wow, April 30th, March 23rd, it's been six weeks. Six weeks of, of new learning, six weeks of an, our world being completely turned around with COVID-19. And I just want to say thank you. Parents, man, hang in there, guys. The school year is almost over. You've uh, accepted all these new challenges. Uh, I know that my wife and I have two kids at home uh, managing their learning while we also try to take care of work. It's not easy. It's tough. Students, I want to encourage you guys. Hang in there. Uh, finish strong. Get your work done. Let's, let's finish this year the way it's supposed to be done because we want to see you make progress. And seniors, we want to get you uh, graduated and celebrate you and make sure that, that we honor you in, in the entire time that you spent at Georgetown ISD. So with that, I just want to uh, spend the rest of this, this uh, communication focused on our seniors, our families, and, and graduation for our entire community. So with that, I want to say, seniors, we love you guys. We're praying for you. We believe in you. When this began, we said we would celebrate you. And we're going to do that. We're going to launch you into your future. June and July await you. Your future awaits you, whether it's college, career, military. It's time for the next steps for you. And we're going to launch you out of here at the end of the year, like we said we were going to do on the first day of school. This is when graduation is going to be, and we're going to get you there. And we're excited about that. So Friday, we announced some things for you that your principals have created specific dates. When you're going to get your cap and gown, how you're going to have a diploma ceremony and go across the stage and get your picture taken, uh, and, and how we're going to have a parade. And guys, here's the deal. This city loves you. Our community loves you. And you deserve to be celebrated. We want to have a parade for all of our Georgetown ISD graduates so that our entire city can celebrate you for all the things that we didn't get to celebrate you for in the spring. And you deserve that. And your families deserve that. So I'm really excited about the parade. And I also want to update you on one more topic. Um, guys, you know that our governor began Reopen Texas uh, this past Monday. And with that, this first phase of Reopen Texas, there are specific markers they are looking at. And, and as you know, there's a lot of things in this that are out of our control. But what I can tell you is this. If we make adequate progress and it looks like things are turning for the good, our team is working on having an outdoor graduation for you at Berkelbach Stadium. There will be one for Richarte, there will be one for Eastview, and one for GHS. And there will be on the dates of your diploma ceremony. So here's the thing. I hope you understand this. Your principals are working hard, and man, they're on their knees praying. They want to make sure that we can do this. And, then, and I also just simply ask that you understand this. There are circumstances beyond our control as to whether or not we can have a gathering the size of a graduation at Berkelbach Stadium. But we are planning on it. We are making arrangements for that to happen. And should the circumstances turn to our favor, that we are committed to pursuing that option for you. So with that, I want you to know this, seniors. Uh, I'm excited about the dates we've designated to celebrate you. I'm ready to see you in that parade, and I'm ready to see your future start. And we're going to make those things happen for you. And, and should things go uh, to our favor, uh, to should we get that break, that we're going to uh, figure out a way to have a high school graduation for you at Berkelbach Stadium. And, and we're going we're gonna to see what happens here. So just know that we're watching it. We're going to communicate with you. We'll keep you updated. Uh, we're working with the county, with all of our officials and other school districts across our area to see if this thing can happen. So with that, just know this, seniors. Like we said in March, you know, we love you, we're praying for you, we believe in you, and we're excited about your future, and we're ready to launch you into that next step. So with that, I hope you have a great weekend, and I hope you finish strong. Thank you.